Hey everyone, my name is Amy. I'm the winemaker for New Clairvaux Vineyard and I wanted to share with you our 2002 Poor Souls Block Barbera Rosé. Now this rosé has got a beautiful strawberry color, um, almost a little bit coral, um, light strawberry like to get this color. Now Barbera, even though the textbooks say it's a super dark, um, dark red wine, in my opinion, it's a lighter red wine. Um, and to get this color in the rosé, we have to treat it a little bit differently than we would a darker variety. And so what we do is we crush the grapes, we put it into tank, and we actually let it sit with the skins for 12 hours, which is an amazing, amazingly long time for a maceration for a rosé. Um, but it comes out with this beautiful color that I absolutely adore. And also the skins have a lot of the flavor in them. And so we don't want to get rid of that right off the bat. So I'm gonna do a tasting. I'll tell you what I pick up in this wine. So we'll swirl it, we'll open it up. Ah, uh, I get, now Barbera is known for high acidity. So um, right off the bat, I get this, this fresh, um, fresh strawberries. I also get some um, raspberries, so some tart red fruit flavors. Let's go ahead and taste it. Oh, I might also add, I also get a little bit of melon in this. Kind of a, there's a delicate flavor as well in here. Let's go ahead and taste it. Yes, it's got the zing, the tangy tartness. Beautiful, lots of strawberry. Almost a jammy, but it's still more on the fresh strawberry side. Definitely raspberries, maybe even some cherries in there, like a tart cherry. Um, no tannins, fresh, crisp, no oak. There was no oak aging at all with this wine. It was all stainless steel fermented and um, and bottled very young so it stays nice and fresh. Uh, if I was to do a food pairing with this, um, the first thing that comes to mind is an acidic tangy cheese like goat cheese. Goat cheese would go really well with this. Think of um, maybe a fresh strawberry salad with goat cheese with some um, champagne vinaigrette or balsamic vinegar, maybe even roasted beets with goat cheese. Um, you can even put some roasted pine nuts on there to add a little bit of texture, or you can even mix in some fresh strawberries. That fresh strawberry flavor is very dominant in this rosé. Um, and if you could also, this rosé is very easy to drink, so you could just um, with even out a food pairing, it's a lovely wine to enjoy on a hot summer day. So cheers to you. I hope you enjoy.